Tyler Morin is described by friends as a survivor. He spent much of his young life, they say, caught up in the world of gangs. But two years ago, he made huge strides in leaving that life when he enrolled in a local gang intervention program called Straight Up. Morin died in hospital earlier this week after an earlier shooting here on this block. Friends that I spoke to today say while Morin had left the gang life behind, he was still struggling with addictions issues. Details around the actual shooting here are still vague, but we do know that Morin survived more than 10 days in hospital with this gunshot wound before finally succumbing to his injuries. Outreach workers that I spoke to today describe Morin as a dedicated learner who is interested in things like math and calculus. Tyler had the guts and the strengths to really work at turning his life around. And that's very, very difficult. That's not, it's not easy to do, to jump into that world of uh, saying, I'm going to be a different human being. But they also mentioned that family members were also involved in the gang lifestyle, and that made that turnaround extremely difficult. Morin's death is the fifth homicide in Saskatoon this year. Charles Hamilton, CBC News, Saskatoon.